First of all, thank you for being here and thank you for signing up to receive videos on how to increase your profits by 30 to 60% or more in 90 days or less without increasing your advertising costs. Now, let's jump right in, shall we? Most of the time I work with folks and they lack one simple thing in their business, just one simple thing, and it's this. It's three simple letters. A USP. Most folks I work with do not have a USP. A USP is your unique selling proposition. Very simple concept, most folks don't have one. Your USP has to do one simple thing, and one simple thing only, and that's this. You have to answer for your prospect this one simple question. Why should I, your prospect, choose to do business with you as opposed to anybody else in town and all other options available to me, including doing nothing at all? Can you answer that? And you have to answer that now, because if you can't, your customer's going somewhere else, man. All right, that's your USP. You have to answer, why should I, your prospect, choose to do business with you as opposed to anybody else in town and all other options available to me, including doing nothing at all? Your USP has to grab your customer or prospect and say, hey man, you wanna work with me and here's why. All right, because you're not the only player in town, I'm sure, neither am I. I'm a business coach and a professional speaker, so what I do, there are probably a dozen other people in my town that do this very same thing. However, if you line them all up, here's where I'm different. Everybody else will say, I'm going to help you get more customers, I'm going to help you close more business, I'm going to help you yada yada yada. I'm the only one that's going to tell you, I'm going to help you increase your business by 30 to 60% or more in 90 days or less without increasing advertising costs. So in a nutshell, I'm gonna help you increase your profits without increasing advertising costs. There isn't a business coach around that's doing that right now. That's what makes me different. Now, as I said before, you aren't the only person in town, so look around at everybody else in your industry and line them up shoulder to shoulder and find out how you're different. What sets you apart? If I go through and ask everybody in town that's doing your line of work, why should I do business with you? Yours is the one that has to stand out because if it doesn't, people are going to leave and go somewhere else. Now, let me give you a couple examples of a USP. This may sound hokey at first. USP, what is this? Well, a USP is very, very important. In fact, a USP helped alter an entire business. All right, I'm going to give you the USP, which, by the way, hasn't been used since the mid-90s. But I'm going to give you this USP, and you're going to know exactly who it is. All right? Fresh hot pizza delivered to you in 30 minutes or less, comma, guaranteed. All right, who is that? It's Domino's Pizza. They haven't used that USP since the mid-90s, but that was their USP that got them on board. You see, when they started their business, nobody in town was delivering pizza in a half an hour, and they certainly didn't guarantee it. Domino's came into town, they started guaranteeing fresh hot pizza and 30 minutes or less, comma, guaranteed. They altered the entire industry of the pizza ordering business. Because of Domino's, now you can get a pizza for less than you know, five minutes. All right, so they completely changed an entire business by a simple USP. Uh, here's another USP. Um, how about pay less shoes? Uh, my wife goes to Payless Shoes. I don't know of any woman that I've ever met that didn't have some pair of Payless Shoes. They're great. reason they're great because you can get a good looking pair of shoes to match a specific outfit for not paying much. So their slogan, their USP was, um, doesn't it feel good to pay less? All right, very simple. Doesn't it feel good to pay less? The rental car industry, they have some ones as well. How about Enterprise? Pick Enterprise. We'll pick you up. All right, great. You know what? I know what you do. That's a USP. I know what you do. Uh, even the Walmart has, you know, they had multiple ones throughout the year, but Walmart was simply always low prices. That's a USP. I know what you do. All right, that grabs my attention and says, okay, always low prices, that's where I'm going to go. Your USP has to tell your customer, client, prospect, why should I come to you as opposed to anybody else in town? All right, and if it doesn't, they're going to other folks in town. Listen. People are busy, and we are bombarded with 40,000 marketing messages a week. 40,000, you've become immune to marketing messages. Yours has to have some kind of benefit. It has to scream benefit to your prospect. If it doesn't, they're going somewhere else, and what they're gonna do is they're gonna go to the least common denominator, and that's gonna be price. 
and you're going to be forced to compete on price and be the lowest uh, bid in town and that's how you're going to get your customers because you don't have a USP. Your USP can help you increase your profits without ever increasing advertising costs. Now, to develop a USP, there's multiple steps and we'll go through that later, but to have a USP, you have to do more than that. Okay, just having a USP and having it here in your mind won't do you any good. You have to integrate that USP and that's how I'm going to show you what to do on the next video. Talk to you soon.